Well, guys, tonight I thought we played uh, UNCW basketball. I, I thought we shared the basketball. Uh, we were able to force tempo. Uh, when you look at it, obviously the numbers that stand out is we made 21 threes, uh, which I'm happy as a coach, but uh, I, I look at it and I'm very happy with the fact that we had 27 assists on 36 made field goals, which was very impressive. I thought we shot the ball well because we passed it well. Uh, I thought we were willing passers. I thought we shared with each other. And um, I thought the guys played with tremendous energy and passion. You know, certainly uh, none of us was happy the way we played. Uh, obviously, the way the game ended, I thought we played great on Thursday. But we wanted to bounce back. And uh, one of the things I've always told those guys in football, when you lose a game, it takes you seven days to get well. Well, we play Thursday and Saturday, so if you lose a game on Thursday, then you got a short turnaround, and we were a little bit sick, and I thought we got well tonight. Given the way things have gone the last two games, uh, just a system cleanse tonight. Uh, was that kind of the mindset coming in just to get the last two games out of the system? Well, we, we had a you know we had a, a bunch of conversations yesterday about playing our basketball, and um, you know we hadn't in the last few games, even the games that we won. Um, you know, we, I didn't feel like we were playing our basketball. And today, you know, we were able to play a lot of guys. You know, we were, our pressure was really good. Uh, we only turned them over 12 times, but we forced them to play fast and forced them into some quick shots. And uh, that's the way we play. Uh, you've always talked about Jalen Forms and how he's been coming along. He gets his first start tonight. And what your big concern about him at this point with his defense? How do you think he played on defense tonight? I thought he was okay. He made some mistakes. Um, but, you know, he, he's a kid that uh, I have to give Jalen a lot of credit and also Ambrose. Um, you know, Jalen had been playing really good in practice, and I wanted to reward him. And, you know, I thought Ambrose, you know, he didn't hang his head. He did a good job coming in the game and made six threes. And, um, you know, I, I thought Jay, because Jalen had played so hard, I wanted a little bit new energy in the lineup, and I thought he did a great job. He started off a little nervous, and then uh, I think he got going. Ambrose said that the guys stayed after him in practice and put up some extra threes and stuff. Obviously, that seems to have paid off tonight. Do they feel, like, can you sense they're feeling a little bit better about that now? Yeah, I mean, nobody, listen, you know, I, I told the guys in the locker room, I said, nobody likes to lose. And I said, certainly, you know, with the game that you lost on Thursday, I said, it could have went either way. You know, Denzel Ingram steps up and makes a shot with 23 seconds on the clock. If they come down and miss, we win the game. I said, so you have to you have to carry on as though you won the game because what happens is if you linger and you let, you know, you hang your head, that loss will cost you to lose another game. And, and certainly we were at home. I thought the crowd was tremendous. Uh, great homecoming crowd. I thought the students were great. And, um, you know, we played with a lot of energy and passion tonight. The fact that you had more assists than you had rebounds. I mean, that's something that doesn't happen very much, but the willingness to share tonight and the crispness of the passing, just how happy are you to see that as a coach? Well, I'm happy, you know, and it's funny because, uh, you know, we, we shot about 70%, so my guys will argue with me and say, Coach, I, when I say why you didn't rebound, they say we didn't miss man, you know, so. <laughs> Any other questions? Coach, thank you very much.